All right. Now we're doing free code camp, responsive web design, learn intermediate CSS by building a cat painting. Step 11. All right. So the next position property is absolute. When we use the absolute value of our position property, for our position property, I mean, uh, the element is taken out of the normal flow of the document. Okay. And then its position is determined by the top, right, bottom, and left properties. All right. Uh, so now we're going to set the position property of our cat head class selector element uh, to absolute, then set the top and left properties to any pixel value. All right. So we're going to make this absolute like this. And uh, I don't think it really did anything. So let's let's... Let's do a control Z. All right, so it moved it down and over just, I mean, I guess up and over it just a little bit like that. Uh, so honestly, I don't know what this is talking about. Uh, absolute value element taken out of the normal flow of the document. I don't really know what that means. Uh, I'm sure we could go over here and say absolute value uh, CSS like that. And it'll tell us more about it if we read through this. But you know what? <laughs> That's good enough. <laughs> so let's check it. It looks good and submit it. All right. And now we're on to uh, step 12. And we'll see you next time.